Yeah, I believe we visionaries because when we came up here, we changed the whole culture. Like, we created a whole house party scene. We added in a lot of DJ feel, you know what I'm saying, took it back on with when nobody used to that up here. And uh, we created a following before our musical following. Um, so, I mean, we have a draw with people. It's more than just talent, you know what I'm saying? We got it. Yeah. Basically, that's the kind of visionary. Everything we do, we, we don't strive to be different, we strive to be us. I feel like we are conveyors of truth. Um, how death is. Because, for one, we're showing our generation uh, that you don't have to stick to the norm to be somebody. And, like, I wake up in the morning and I'm like, I have to do this shit. Not just for me, but for my people and everybody else to be able to see, oh, I don't have to stick to the regular format of life to be something. I could step out and say, forget this degree. I'm going to go be what I want to be. You know, the true American dream. This hip hop, this is our birthright. Like, this is another avenue, like out. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't have to go be a doctor. You don't have to do this. You don't have to sell drugs. You don't have to rob. You don't got to be a stick up kid. You can rap. You can do hip hop. We created this. You know what I'm saying? I was watching the, what is it, uh, the Ice T something from nothing. And, you know, they created something for us when we had nothing. And so, you know, I'm like, this is my birthday, man. I'm going to take advantage of this. And I'm going to do this hip hop thing. To be compared to some of the great, you know, duos, hip hop duos to do it. I mean, it's definitely an honor, and, and, I'm, and I'm always grateful to be compared with the Outkast and the UGKs and, and, and all of those, those, those great hip-hop duos. We're a lot different from those, from, from, from those groups. For one, because we're not just down south rap or east coast rap or midwest, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like we got all of them in one. Definitely an honor. A little overwhelming to be compared to them. I mean, just, we're talking about a group that went down, of yes. course. And uh, here we are yeah. struggling just to make it out. And um, I mean, the fact that we're a duo, of course, we're gonna be compared to them on the top. So we just we, we try to um, we try to live up to the legend. At least like you know, that's something we striving to be along along our way to the top. We definitely feel like we're something different. It's like two Southern rappers who were fans of East Coast rap, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They're fans of soul music, fans of the blues, and it, it all comes together so well just to create a whole, hopefully what we're trying to do is a whole new genre. Fuck the world to them springs bust. First class nigga, limousine blunts. Put hoes down, got my cheese up. These niggas sweeter than freeze cups. Still Green up, still lean up. Yo girl is on knees nuts, she probably don't be up. You don't have to be corporate America because your mom and dad is corporate America. Or, you know, you don't have you don't have to be a musician because your parents are a musician. You know, you got you do what you do. Do what you love to do. And that's my favorite saying is do what you do. Because you can't do what anybody else does. We got this itching drive to get stuff done. Always. Whatever we do, we trying to get stuff done. Trying to do it bigger than who's doing it around us and trying to do it the best. That's what separates us from everybody else. That is what that's what has elevated us to the level that we are at right now. And then, you know, you throw in the fact that we are two of the coldest MCs in the state. Um, we don't look half bad. We got a little personality. Uh, we push, push, push our music. Uh, go chase in my coffin, man, cause I'm fresh to death and I'm stunned. Right. Go rings in my coffin, man, cause I'm fresh to death and I'm stunned. Right. Sachi frames in my coffin, man, I'm from the 501 where them niggas banging. This gold rings in my coffin, man, cause I'm fresh to death and I'm stunned. Uh. Swag it, 
Too much for comprehension. Pay attention. I don't quit at anything. I don't I don't care if it's it, it could be a tying your shoe competition. Who could do it the best? If I lose, I'm gonna wanna practice and practice. And I'm gonna call you and challenge you again to this shoe tying contest and I'm gonna spank you that next time. Like it's that real. I don't like to lose. Uh, I'm definitely a competitor at, at everything, at, at anything I do. Um, and I feel like that's what was in me that, that won't allow me to fail. And we treat it like a competition. Like We treat it like it's a sport. Like I'm so hungry and I'm coming for everybody around me. And I don't know, I don't like people being better than me at things. And so all of that together, you kind of got high depth. You kind of got these two dudes just kind of cocky. Um, outside looking in, like, is it deserving? I don't know. Our fans know what's up. You know, they know we high. So, that's what makes us. We, we're high def, man. We're HD. Like, you can see us clearly. You can see us clear. The way we spit, the way we, our demeanor, how we do things, everybody can see that we them do. If my music is heard, my voice is heard, and I can travel around this world and, and touch people, and change lives on this journey, then to me that's success. Music is what I love to do. You know, I want to become successful off of my music. So, I don't know. I can't say that success would be being the next hole, you know what I'm saying? Being a, a billion dollar man. But if, if I'm eating off of what I'm doing and I'm constantly advancing every day, then I feel like you know, I'm on the way to success if I'm not successful yet. Uh. And I'm throwing ones to you done Just that house party off house party My real niggas got that one Looking into my future I see red wine and kryptonite This that shit that Jesus drank Girl, come get some of this afterlife yeah. It's wood Nigga, this my party already